My uncle made this. What's up, YouTube? Y'all know what it is, and y'all know who it is. It's your boy, Texas Man, checking in the game, music mo. Hope y'all having a good week, man. It's already starting the weekend right now. If y'all didn't know, which y'all probably already do know or have seen a little bit of times, a few times, maybe a lot of times from your favorite YouTubers, favorite shoe tubers. Got these bread fold things on deck, man. This is something you cannot do. Let me repeat myself. This you can buy. You cannot do this. As you can see, I'm doubled up shout A. <laughs> you know I had to say that, right? If you watched my last video, you know I hurt my back. My back's feeling, I say about between 85 to 90 percent better. I'm not quite 100 percent. I don't know if it's my sleeping surface or if it's I did something to tweak it. I don't know, but it's feeling better though. I'm not gonna open up bo both pairs. I got my wife's pair, as y'all can see, and I got my pair. So I got a GS and I got a men's pair. Got my early on the sneakers app. Like I said before, y'all already seen other people tell y'all the story about how they had a shock drop and then they canceled it at the last minute and then it came back. Most people got them. I think there was there was paying attention within the first 10 15 minutes these do come out next month anyways though so these pairs early right now but this is my first pair of Jordan 4's for those y'all who can't read just do it Nike box OG follow me on IG those y'all who know what's up it's Texas main Texas with a Z M A N E pop cha cha slide pop Get that out of here. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. Table. What does that say? Flight. OG box. So all y'all can see that haven't seen before. Let me read it to y'all real quick. Size 12, black, fire, red, cement, gray. A lot of people call these the bread force. The real true OG name is the black cement force. If you happen to give a damn. You ready? Three. Two, one. It's upside down because I'm gonna check it out. Damn, something holding my pair down. That thing got stuck. What the hell? Bruh. Do y'all see this? Look, well, I don't already ru ruin the unboxing, but look. Factory flaw. Oh! Look, this stuck for real. Man, this is crazy unboxing. What the hell? Bro, is anybody else's pair doing this? What the? F what in the Jordan brand? Hell is going on? I had to pull it out. Y'all already seen it anyways. Y'all seen it the same time I seen it. I go my pair of hair. Oh man. Hey, so y'all saw that, right? I ain't nothing playing, ain't nothing scripted. I'm gonna pull them out again. Y'all saw before I did. Um Y'all didn't get to see my reaction because I had my hands right there. I was I was shocked when that happened. But for the record, this is my first pair of Jordan 4s. So you can say it's my first pair of OGs in the Jordan 4 silhouette. I do like Jordan 4s. I don't own any. I struck out on Travis Scott. Y'all know I was sour. A couple of my homeboys got them. I wasn't sour at them. I was just sour because I didn't get to, what was it called? I didn't get a chance to get the early release. And blue is my favorite color for those of y'all who do not know. So the Travis Scott 4s were struck out. I should have copped them when they were like 240, 260 in my size. Now they're 500, so I'm never going to get them. The other ones that I really messed up on were the... The royalty fours, I had them in hand twice at the store. I felt like the price was going to dip, dip, dip. As soon as the price did, them things was gone, man. That was my bad. I'll get them one day, though. But, yeah, so y'all ain't going to see my original reaction to these. Quality is A1, man. I ain't going to front, bro. As y'all know, I'm not a huge fan of all black sneaks. But the bread colorway, especially in the bread 11s, which are coming out this year, and the bread 1s, which I don't own. I love the bread colorway. I don't know what to think of this sneaker right now, man. 
Like, I was for real, like, just gonna probably get rid of it, honestly, because I'm not, I wasn't even excited about this shoe when it came out, because it just don't, it just don't grab me, you know what I mean? Seeing it in hand, it is a lot better. Honestly, it's a lot better in person than it is in the pictures. Or if you have the old releases, you know what I'm saying. Bro, but like, for real. But like, for real, for real, man, like. Hey, man, these, these are dope, though. I gotta decide if I'm gonna keep them or not. I know a lot of people are like, you crazy, you don't keep them. You crazy, you crazy, you don't keep them. I don't know. My thing is if I'm gonna wear them or not. It's not that I don't like them. I actually do like them. They're better in person. See, you got that flight right there on the tongue. As you see in the orange hang tag hanging around on their little, what they call these wingettes, right? Or something like that. Wings or wingette things right here. They're gray. The suede or the. It has another name. I, I think it's just suede, but it hasn't. I forgot what the other what they're calling it. Not new buck, but something else kind of buck. It's very clean on here. Uh, my pair, I don't see a lot of errors. A lot of errors is in glue stains. Air bubbles clean. Everything's clean right here. Take out the right shoe. Man, my heart kind of stopped. Man, I thought there was a. I thought there was a wear crease right there. I was like, what? Nike better not have sent me no BS with a crease in it. I need to try them on. Hey, man, I ain't even gonna front, man. The, the quality is, is really dope. Like, really, really dope. You got your Air Jordan upside down underneath the tongue. Okay, so before we get mad, I, I gotta tell y'all right now, I still don't know if I'm gonna keep them or not, man. I don't, I don't get that feeling. I got this feeling. With these, like, when I see a pair of shoes that I gotta have, I get that, let me get a good correlation. I get that Power Ranger feeling, man. You know when they get ready to morph? It's morphin' time! You wanna see them change? Dragon Sword! It's morphin' time! <laughs> I get that feeling when I see a pair of kicks that I gotta have. It's like a little fire inside me starts burning that I just gotta get it and I copy real quick. But you know, everyone who's a sneakerhead or a collector or who's a hype beast, they got that what I call ACD disease, the automatic copying disease, man. You have an opportunity to get something real quick and you're so used to sneakers and hype clothing and everything else selling out so fast you don't even think you just buy it real quick right so that's what i did with these i didn't even think i was going to get access uh honestly because i've been catching nothing but ales on on the nike on the sneaky on the sneaky on the nike app for months man like i, I almost like just was like i'm just gonna take a break from it these are dope man the, the, the black netting on there now nah, i don't me personally the quality is way better on these than they are on the royalty fours because royalty fours are kind of like dandruffy like you know, like kind of like faded look, kind of like low quality. Um, this is a real great quality, bro. Like I can't even front, man. This this is like, I don't know, it's just a one, bro. But again, I don't know if I'm gonna keep them or not. They are fresh. I just don't know if I'll wear them, man. You know, that's that's my thing. Hey, comment below if you're gonna wear these. Comment below if you got them early. Comment below if you caught an L. You know, everybody with Jays in general, they gotta have that Nike on that ass. People get wet, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, honestly, I, I didn't even show y'all, but I just tried these things on, and they are snug, bro. Like I'm gonna have to get a 12 and a half and anything in Jordan fours, man, because it's hurting the right side of my foot. Like, and I didn't even walk anywhere. I was just sitting in place, and I got on dry fit socks, so it was kind of hard to get in there. But once I got in there. I already noticed it right away. It could be because it's factory lace and it's still tight, but I still shouldn't be feeling the shoe rub against my right foot like that. Uh, I think these are gonna have to go, bro. Now, as I end this video and put these back in here, I'm still, if y'all can't tell, I'm not excited, man, like like I am when I do unboxings. Maybe it's because I'm a little tired from the gym, but I'm not getting that feeling out of these, man. So, you know, my channel, I'll keep it 100 with y'all, man. 100%. I love the colorway, but I'm gonna have to say, I'm not really feeling them, bro. Like, that's just me, man. Like, it is a clean on, on the way it looks. Like, just everything. The, the quality is great. I like the hang tag. And I like Jordan 4s. But this colorway in the Jordan 4 is not for me, man. Uh, I skipped on the dunks, as y'all know. Remember the, the bread dunks that just came out? I, I love the way those look. But then again, I skipped on those. Patent leather pops. The only reason why I skipped on those is because the Jordan 11 breads are supposed to come out this year. And if I could have those breads and the one breads, that's all the breads I need, bro. Like, real talk. But if the four is my silhouette, then th the quality on this is great. Outstanding. This is the best four quality that I've seen on all the fours that I held in my hand. Even though I've never copped any. But I want to thank y'all for watching. Let me know your thoughts on this, man. Y'all ain't mad at your boy, are you? Because 
I'm not happy right now, man. I'm not I'm not mad either. I'm just not I don't have that excitement about these pair, man. You know what I mean? Maybe because it didn't fit me, man. You know when something don't fit right, you're anticipating then it's kind of like your hopes get down, man, when it don't fit right. Maybe that's what it is, bro. I don't know, man, but I want to thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to like if you will. Subscribe if you're real. Till next time, we're about this thing. <laughs>